and welcome to our Insight Interviews, where we take a closer look at some of the films in the lineup for the Canberra International Film Festival of 2011. I'm your host, Vicky Collins, and today we're looking at Swedish film Sebe. I have with me here at Dendi Cinemas, Festival Director Simon Weaving is going to answer a few questions for us. Simon, thanks for coming along again. It's a pleasure to be here. There's an interesting aspect to this, isn't there, where the director himself is not Swedish, but he moved to Sweden at about the same age as Sebe is in the film. And we're getting, I think, perhaps a, a quite an accessible outsider's view of Sweden, aren't we? What's he trying to yeah, say? Yeah, it's, it's very interesting. Um, Babak Najafi, the director, is actually from Iran, and he left Iran uh, when the revolution happened in, in, in the 80s, and he was only 12 when he came to mm. Sweden. And you get this very strong sense of somebody who's looking at Sweden and Swedish society from the outside and he said himself that he he often felt that most people behind the camera were from the middle class and he and he obviously wasn't and so his perspective on Swedish society on this I guess this woman who's living pretty much in poverty yeah. but they're they're very ordinary people in a sense they're not and he's made this point he didn't want the poverty to be connected to crime and to be connected to alcoholism or drug taking they're people who are just like us, they're everyday people, but they're living in impoverished circumstances. Mm -hmm. And I think it's a really refreshing way of telling a story. Yeah, agreed. And there's a lovely parallel going on between Sebe's life and his mother's life. Um, it's, would you say it's a story about dependence, that, that, you know, which one is dependent more on the other? Yeah, absolutely. Here's Sebe, who's only 15, he's, he's bullied at school, and he does depend upon his mother emotionally for support. And ultimately, it's it's her inability to support him because she's got all of her own problems mm. to deal with that causes him to go a bit off the edge, which is which is where the film's sort of heading. Yeah, fantastic. That's what I love about this film. There's some really pertinent personal issues that are going to relate to anyone in a family, um, but is a, a really interesting story that, that crescendos yeah. at the end in, in it, something it, it quite does. unexpected. And, and I guess we get the sense of this driven character. Absolutely. And there's, there's a lineup of those, isn't there, in the, in the festival this year? There is indeed. We have a whole strand of films uh, in a strand called Driven, and they're all about these really focused characters. And, and it's a lovely example of, of that kind of film. Fantastic. Well, there you have it, folks. Watch out for the Driven series and, in particular, Sebe. The festival starts on 26th of October. Details are on this site.